1.4 chart of account in this task you will learn how to delete how to rename and how to create new account first go to gl then click on account maintenance inside this account maintenance you will see a few accounts already been created based on the sample chart of account of trading company that we selected before and in under account maintenance you will see three different colors has been highlighted with different account the first color is a beige color the beige color symbolize of account type account type will not have any account number and will not bring any transaction the second color is a white color the white color here have two meanings the first meaning is normal accounts and the second meaning as a parent's account and the third color is a blue color the blue color here means of special account all the special accounts consist of fixed asset bank cash deposit debtors control accounts creditor control accounts stock accounts and also retain earning and all those four under these six categories must create as a special account special account have their own special treatment and we will go through one by one during this task a remove this account to remove two methods for you to choose the first one either you scroll up and down to search for the accounts that you want to delete or you may use the find column to find the accounts that you need insert the names of the accounts inside the find column then click on enter after that click the buttons of delete account after you select the account once the account be deleted it will be permanently delete then remove the others account others debtors other creditors higher purchase creditor and also higher purchase interest and spend b rename the following account we assume previously before we use the system we already have our own chart of account so we have to rename it accordingly inside the sample chart of account and our example is previously we don't use the name of return inwards so we have to rename first highlight return inwards then click the edit account button on the left side then rename it to sales return click save C. Remove the existing stock accounts and create a new set of stock accounts. First, remove the accounts under current asset, which is stock. Under cost of goods sold, stock at beginning of year and stock at the end of year. After all these three stocks have been removed, Click stock button on the left side to create a new set of stock accounts. Stock account is a special special account as you need to create all three sets together. Once you done create all the stocks accounts, click on save. D. Remove the existing bank account and create three new banks account. 
In our account, we only create one bank account as a sample and we name it as a cash app bank. If your company only consists of one bank account, you may edit the name of the bank. In our situation, we assume we have three new bank account and we don't want to use the given by the system. First, delete the cash app bank with the account number of 3101000. After you highlight the cash app bank 3101000, then click the delete account. After you delete, to create a new bank's account, you must highlight the parent's account. In this case, the parent's account is not current asset, but cash at bank. So, you must highlight cash at bank first, then click the button of Bank Cash Deposit. Create the first bank account by the name of MBBKL. Make sure the accounts is for under banks and the account types is current asset. Account number is 310 MBB1. Description is MBBKL. Under this bank, we have two payment methods involved. The first one is MB check. The journal type is bank, payment by and payment type for under check. The second payment method for into this bank account is MBC card. Journal type is bank. Payment by and payment type is by credit card. Once you done create the first bank account, then click on save. Create the second accounts by the name of PBBPJ. Highlight parents which is cash at bank, then click again bank cash deposit. The second account number is 310PBB1. Description is PBBPJ. There's only one payment method involved, which is PBBPJ. The payment by and payment type is by check. The third bank's account is 310 CIMB. Description is CIMB KL. And the payment method only once, which is CIMB KL. Payment by and payment type fall under check. Once you've done the last bank account, click on save. You may check back all the three bank accounts under Cash App Bank. E. Add a new fixed asset account. Fixed asset account is a special account as you need to create together with accumulate position account. Before you create, you have to highlight the parents. And in this case, the parents account is a fixed asset white color which is 200000. Highlight the fixed asset parents account, then click the fixed asset button. Create the new fixed asset account by the number of 205,000. Description is ICT and computer. Once you click on enter, automatically the system will be override the description for you. Before you click on save, enter first the account number which is 205005. Once you're done, click Save. You will see a new fixed asset account by the name of ICT and Computer already add on into your fixed asset account. F. Add two new normals account. For the new normals account, you still have to highlight the parents. And in our case, the parents account is expenses which beige color. Highlight the parents account expenses, 
then click the button new normal account. We need to add two new normal account by the account number 902 1000 then the description is sales expenses. Once you're done, click S to add the column. The second normal account we need to create is by the account number 902-2000, description is marketing expenses. Once you're done, click on save. The last one under this task which is G, change account number. For your information, all those accounts that you already saved, if you click on edit, you cannot edit or amend the account number. To amend the account number, you have to go to Tools, Change Code, Change Account Number. Click the plus sign to add a column. Then, search for Bank Charges. Once you search for the bank charges, automatically the description will be filled in for you. What you need to do is enter the new account number for the bank charges which is 916-0000. Once you're done, click on change. If the account number is repeated, the system won't allow you to click on change and you have to change with a new account number. Once you're done, Go back to the account maintenance and check back under your expenses. Your bank charges should be changed with the new numbers already. Done with task 1.4.